Hi everyone, T let's figure out how to define gravity. To define gravity, we'll need a cup, some water, and a cardboard. So let's start. First, fill the cup with some water. Then, you want to hold the cup like this. Then, take the cardboard, place it like this, and give a lot of pressure and then turn it around and still give a lot of pressure so it stays in for a long 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 time so then slowly take it off then let's record one two three Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five. 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, <coughs> Nine. So this is this is how you defy gravity. And be safe. Be careful to not get yourself wet. Are you guys surprised how water and cardboard stick together? Well, I'm going to explain how it does. The water, the water and cardboard stay together even though the the glass is upside down. Because there's no air inside the glass. The air pressure outside this glass is greater than the pressure of the water inside the glass. The extra air pressure manages to hold the cardboard into place, defying gravity. Gravity is the Earth's force that pulls objects towards it and prevents them from floating off into space. Thank you guys for watching this and I'll see you in the next video.